90 Day Fiance the other way is Brandon and Mary, now a family of three, sharing with ET this exclusive first look at their newborn daughter named Midnight. This is a fresh start for us. <laughs> yes, it is. I like that. Check out the little cutie, all swaddled in pink and white blankets. Even though we were trying to make a baby, I still have anxiety, like, how am I gonna take care of this kid? You know, what kind of father do I wanna be? Midnight was born on August 15th via C-section, and Mary tells ET, when I heard our baby crying for the first time, I got teary-eyed, and I was so happy to realize I have a baby adding, I've never been this happy in my whole life. Mary and Brandon's journey to parenthood and marriage hasn't been easy, and it's all played out on TLC. He's still playing his game so much and not focusing on the real life. The two met after more than two years of obsessively video chatting with one another. Oh my God. <laughs> But once they were together in Mary's native Philippines, her grandparents put their foot down on any intimacy between the two, including kissing. I always respect my grandparents, but I don't want to tell Brandon we can't do anything without their permission. I had no idea this is a rule. It's just really absurd to me. Like, I, I think that I deserve to be able to kiss her without asking for permission but I guess their culture is a lot different than I was expecting. Which made things difficult when they announced Mary's pregnancy to her family. I was fully on board. And then she's like, you know, I just really, really want a baby. And I thought trying to make a baby will help us become a better couple. Now that she's pregnant, I'm like, oh, this is really happening. Like, what? Things just got a lot more complicated. Fast forward to their wedding day, Mary had second thoughts about going through with things. Even though Brandon's mom really helps me to understand how much I love him, I feel like I'm not ready to marry him because he still didn't reassure me that I can trust him to be man enough to be a father and my future husband. In the end, Mary and Brandon tied the knot in a beautiful ceremony. I promise you that you will never have to worry about me abandoning you. I want to spend my life, my whole life with you forever. Mary, do you take Brandon to be your lawful wedded husband? I do. Brandon, do you take Mary to be your lawful wedding wife? I do. But things took a turn when it started raining beetles. I'm looking over and there's like this fog rolling in. Oh my gosh. And I realized that's not a fog, that's, that's a lot of bugs. There's hundreds of bugs everywhere. From bugs to baby, it's been a whirlwind for this couple who's now a family of three. I think the future will be positive for me and Brendan.